hi, this is Julie and she is going to help us in the kitchen today, if you don't mind. Not at all, but I don't want to do the dishes. And why not? Ballerinas don't do dishes. Julie dances ballet here in San Francisco. So, we have a ballerina in the kitchen today. To be honest, I shouldn't complain. Look at that body and the fragile frame. Looks like I'm doing the dishes again. Thank you, Julie, that was very nice. Anyway, in the previous video, we have prepared the tortellini pasta with a creamy prosciutto sauce and it came out really, really good. However, whether you're cooking pasta for yourself or preparing a romantic dinner, pasta alone will not be enough. You will have to light up the candles and turn some romantic music on. That will help, but it still will not be enough. What you need is a really good salad to go with your pasta. And a creamy Caesar salad is a traditional way to accompany an Italian dinner. What's interesting is that this famous Caesar salad was invented in Mexico and in all of the places in Tijuana, but not in Italy. At least it was an Italian chef who has created it, right? Yes, and his name was Caesar Cardini. So let's make the creamy, tangy and garlicky Caesar salad to serve with our next Italian dinner. We'll start by preparing the croutons which is optional if you are making a dinner for yourself. But if you are trying to impress, every detail counts. So, you better make an effort. That is, if you have someone to impress. So, I will cut the bread. And I will chop the parsley. You can make as many croutons as you like. And one or two tablespoons of chopped parsley. Put the bread cubes in a bowl. Sprinkle a little bit of salt. A little bit of pepper. That is black pepper. And the garlic powder. If you are using, if you are using garlic flavored uh, olive oil, that's okay but I have garlic powder and that's what I will use today. A little bit of olive oil. A tablespoon or two of finely chopped parsley and mix everything very well together. Transfer your croutons to a tray and put it in the oven, preheated to 325 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes. And while the croutons are toasting, I will make the dressing. And I will chop the lettuce. And for the dressing, we will need two tablespoons of lemon juice. That's juice of about one lemon. Quarter teaspoon of black pepper. Three quarter teaspoon of Dijon mustard. And three quarter teaspoons of Worcestershire sauce. And one garlic clove, pressed or grated and a quarter cup of mayonnaise oh that's a very little mayonnaise yes and i like it this way if you want to make your own you can always find homemade 
mayonnaise recipe amongst my other videos. But anyway, let's add half a cup of any vegetable oil, canola or avocado or even olive oil in a very thin flow while blending all the ingredients together. Let's add quarter cup Parmesan cheese, mix it well, and it's ready. Why didn't you add the anchovies? Well, Cesar Cardini didn't have anchovies in his original recipe anyway. And besides, this dressing is so good that you don't even need the anchovies. Our croutons are not ready yet, but earlier this morning I have baked some. Look at how beautiful they are, speckled with tiny green bits of parsley and have a light garlicky flavor. So let's add the croutons to the romaine lettuce. Add some dressing. Mix everything together. Put it on a plate. And you, Julie, can taste it now. video we are going to prepare the healthiest Caesar dressing in the world with miso paste, tahini and the amino acids. Wow, that sounds very healthy and definitely more suitable for a ballerina. <laughs>